Oh, man, it's good to be back, right, guys? Yeah, sure is. When's the Godzilla comics coming back? Yeah, sh soon, right, Kuga? Yeah, I just took a small break. They're coming. I'm still gonna do FNAF, everything. Just just hold on. All right, then. Anyways, everyone, today we're gonna react to a Goji Center video. Why is Titanus and who luck? Probably mispronounced that. I don't care. I'm the king of the monsters. Terrified of Godzilla. Yeah, that's right, me, baby. Uh, Titanus and who luck? Explained. You, you didn't even try. No, I did not. Neither did Koga. Anyways, with that said, be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and let's get to the video. Cougar, you know what to do. That's right, boys. Welcome back to the Titan Observatory. Oh, Today, good to be, be back, Goji Center. Good to be back. Ooh, strangers, you say? Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, let's, okay. Let's that's just uh, go somewhere else that's that, safe. That, yep, 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 let's go. Oh, okay, bye, everyone. Go to super safe. Oh, don't worry, we already are. You know what? The Before subscribe button buzzed back. Some disturbing oh, look, we're animals. doing ads? Let us tell you about Why don't you do those? You Have you seen my thumbnails? Oh, yeah. This no one wants to you. It's rad. Right. Let's get back to Amulok. Oh, yeah, Amulok. That's a pronounced. This video is divided it. into three parts. Okay, Amulok's okay. Longer time for Kuka's arms to get tired. And yep. Special powers and anatomy. Ooh, special powers, you say? I like the anatomy bit. So do I. Stop it. Get pretty disturbing. Ooh, so disturbing, ahead. I like that. Uh, this. don't worry. We, oh, oh, okay, then. The legend of originates from California Amulok. folklore. That's how you say These were an indigenous tribe uh, see, in what is now folklore. the state gotcha. of Oregon. The myth states state of Oregon, Amulok okay, okay. Near a lake, near I love my Oregon. <laughs> about 15 miles west Stop it. Of Forest Grove. Here okay, is where the horrendous dragon-like creature was spotted. Oh, this okay, it's dragon-like. Oh, look, it's a cute little puppy dragon. Horns on its cute skull. little puppy dragon. Its indeed. Come here, little buddy. Let me give you your bets. I don't think so you like that. Looked pretty horrifying. Yeah, What's even more yeah, it does, scary but it's a cute little puppy dragon. Totally. Doing, drowning others. Here's oh, the messed up part of it. That's kind of messed up. An old Here it is. States that three kids were wandering near the lake where this okay. furry dragon lived. Once spotting okay. its beautiful horns, these kids decided to jump on this dragon. Oh, they you guys, you deserved it. You don't jump on a dragon, you dummies. Obviously, yeah, if you jumped on me, you just die. Same with me, I'm not going to let you do that. in two of these kids getting impaled by the horns and <laughs> staying there. The oldest impaled. surviving child later went to tell oh, man, his dad, to be who that later came kid. over, only to witness the impaled children say, we have changed bodies, before oh. finally being drowned okay, by then. Amulek. Change bodies. Yeah. See, I told you that you should have skipped ahead. I, I, yeah, we should have. We We're sorry, Goji Center. Why didn't you warn us more? Yeah. Creature, let's now talk about the MonsterVerse Amulek. Okay, this let's do it. First introduced in the film Godzilla King of the Monsters Ooh, when it was awakened that. by Ghidorah with orders to wreak havoc in populated areas. Where did he come but from? Where? We just discussed that this cryptid amulet lived in a random lake in Oregon. Yeah, some random lake, bro. This amulet. Oh, this we did. Oh, dear God, what is that More thing? I do not know. Rock formations, which oh, so we lived in Russia. Where Ichi's from. This is totally. Also important. Wait, Stay isn't he from space? But he has a Russian later. accent. Yeah, Before that didn't make sense, but whatever. Arms, Monarch had already set up camp in this area. Oh, gotcha, a gotcha. And containment facility for Titanus Amulet. Use my nose. Yeah, but as you. most of us already know, this guy broke free from the enclosure and most likely headed towards oh, okay, the tourist yep, center broke nearby, free. destroying Yeah, he buildings, definitely murdered some roads, and ultimately killing off anyone who got in the way. Oh, yeah, he did. <laughs> Destruction. Populated. The next most inhabited city is oh, good. 100 Population's miles away. Low. So we can guess Only I can murder innocents. By accident, of course, of wink. The idea was for all the Titans to converge oh, in Boston. Oh, okay. Okay, and just converge in Boston. But yeah, not that didn't happen. Now did it. Three-headed freak. Fast forward a few months and the Titans begin stirring up trouble again. Yeah, they do. You know, Kuga, you should dub that Skeela comic. No, don't worry, I will. Benevolent Titans, Titanus Behemoth. A more or less peaceful, but yeah, behemoth. We love you, you big, you big sucker for love. I love you. Skull, yeah, man. But not even these could protect it from this freak of nature. Oh, the how's that? Novel, Godzilla Dominion, Amulek travels oh, that's a great gra to graphic novel. Who's gonna double one day? I promise. Another yeah, totally. Wooded area and more populated. Here, Amulek decides oh, to man. Behemoth, and How dare you attack baby behemoth? He just wants love and peace. Oh, this damn! This has some sort of elasticity property in its limbs. It's got like a big old rubber band. And deal tremendous damage. This is looking okay, good Okay, that's for a Amulok, sick design, but, but really terrifying. They got company. Oh, oh yeah. The oh, yeah. The novel proceeds to mention that both of these titans are fighting for one thing. Okay, resources. what's that? 
Oh, so this resources. Is okay. Behemoth spits back Scratch my nose. The hard I got you. Its tusk, and yeah, it yeah go Behemoth. The teeth out of Amulok. Uh, remember, no teeth for you, bud. Tennis Amulok has better range and throws a punch yeah, so powerful he does. that it knocks Behemoth flat And he got sucker punched. Not Godzilla sure how that works, but all right then. Just on time to witness this. It was his prerogative Ooh. as the Alpha to decide who keeps this particular territory. Godzilla's role in this planet is to okay, establish okay. order. Okay, okay, keeps checked. Yep, I do. I do that. Of nature. So that said, the better candidate to keep this jungle was Behemoth. Yes, keep the jungle know, this Behemoth. Guy's colossal feces act as a hyper fertilizer. Yeah, they do, to grow baby. Back at alarming rates. It's also a good soup. Restore fair oxygen levels for the whole planet. Ew. Amulux win in this battle would undo all of that. As yeah, that's Amulux true. Drags Behemoth to drown him in deeper water. Don't you Godzilla do it. Intervenes by tossing him <laughs> formation. This angers Amulux. But he's now oh, it angers him, but I'm not scared of you. So he That's right, I'm going to atomic breath you into nothing. That's an right, you submission. bow, snitch. Saved by Godzilla, Behemoth re oh, yeah, now thank you, Behemoth. Thank you, Cover Go, fixing the monarch enclosure in the, you know, the, the, the rainforest. On the other hand, now has to find another place to call yeah, home. you go live at the bottom so of the ocean, but not my pots at the bottom of the ocean. Godzilla? What about him prevented Because he's a wuss. This enormous risk? To find out, let's enter the Titan analysis platform. Okay, let's Titanus do it. Titanus Amulok is one of those Titans that you look at and have no yeah. idea how to Yeah, no idea what it does, That's no idea what it looks like, no idea if it's guy or girl. in the natural yeah. world that is composed in the same way. By closely observing the textures and corporal composition All right. Oh, I like your animation, guys. Very good job, Goji Center. Yeah, killing it. Sourced from aberrated vegetation. Aberrated vegetation. I totally know what that means. I'll be right back, by the way, Kong. All right, then. You guessed it. Trees, roots, moss, Ooh, vines, trees and roots and stuff. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Flora. In this section, okay, we what about Flona? You know, like just pretty flowers Edward on them. Johnson, All right, I'm back. Of this what, I, what I miss? Perhaps oh, the most important takeaway from this Titan is the fact that this monster, believe it or not, is actually composed of a head, spinal cord, and extended oh, nerve connections. Okay, okay. It's not a bug, it's a person. Yeah, functions. totally. Its head houses an extremely powerful brain with a capability known Ooh. as telekinesis. Oh no, is, is it powerful like Rogue or whatever? Jean Grey? I don't know. I don't care. Contact. Similar to what you see Atomic Star Breath Wars beats Telekinetus every single time. This Whoa, man, Star Wars is metachlorian. On the monster versus more yeah. realistic take on this yeah, universe. But the concept is simple. Using this extremely powerful brain, Amulak would be okay. able to control the surrounding vegetation. Oh, so he's got plant talking powers. Okay. Okay, that's pretty cool, actually. Four legs, so he chooses to look that ugly? All right. And seemingly elastic kaiju. This oh, he's elastic. Okay, illusion. that's pretty sweet. That, that makes sense. Then I like it. Elastic, but it was mentioned that this was in fact Amulux's ability to telepathically move the elements, creating. Oh, okay, that's pretty cool, actually. I really like Amulux now. Yeah, I mean that is a cool ability, but it's no atomic muscles, breath, but with and it's no axe. Yeah, it's better than axe. No, it's not. This is yes, about is. to get really technical, but bear okay, with us. Okay, okay, I'll this try. Quote unquote, Big words are hard. Amulux to move things telepathically can be explained by understanding I'll be right back, particles known as gravitons. These Thank you, buddy. Proven to exist yeah, yet. don't mention. I'm just but still fixing essence, it. These okay. are the literal components that make up a gravitational force. Okay. Let us explain. Visible light, radio waves, and other forms of radiation. Oh are made God, up we're getting into science. I, I'm open out of this. Similarly, but science is power. Gravity is composed Knowledge of is power. All right, in then. this case, Amulux's brain has the capability to right, manipulate these subatomic particles, do, allowing do, do, it to do, move do, do, objects. Do, 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 this, however, do, does do, have limitations, do. since it's mentioned that Amulux can move only plant matter, not oh, only plant matter. Objects, okay. Such as metal or concrete. Now that we so he's not Magneto. Oh, gotcha. can only be made of densely packed vegetation. Okay, that makes sense. I guess you can say it's flammable now. Number yep. one, as mentioned in the book, the reason Amulek and Behemoth fought over this territory was because of resources. Oh, okay, so Behemoth they both wanted, you know, the, the plants. Gotcha. The creature most likely fed on, you guessed it, vegetation. Amulek, oh, that's how nice he's eating Amulek. Vegetation to yeah, what are they think they're going to get bigger and stronger and take know, you on? Still wouldn't have won. Would have burned him to death. Oh, gotcha. In the world. Containing I mean, until McDonald's keeps cutting it down for pasture. <laughs> yeah, that's right. I should totally stomp McDonald's into the ground. We probably should, but man, their burgers are tasty. Remember, so this guy nice. originally came from a place already surrounded by trees. Oh, okay, yeah. This place was even better, providing a yeah, huge it is. It's you know just all trees. 
but being made out of vegetation can have its yeah. weaknesses. You know, like flammable. Number two. Earlier in this video, we mentioned that Amulek did not even bother to put up a fight against Godzilla. Maybe it's because I could this light him on fire. Either. Probably. Getting a fight with another Titan with incendiary capabilities <laughs> would send a walking plant to the end credits. Yeah, Not yeah, it would. That a bunch of vines and trunks jumbled up together would be relatively simple to blast through, meaning that Amulek wouldn't really ever pick fights with the likes of Ghidorah, yeah. Mechagodzilla, yeah. and obviously the G-Man himself. I mean, he might fight Mechagodzilla because he's like an abomination head. in Since nature made of metal. Yeah, man, I like to believe he would. Body, this would technically mean that the only way to really kill off this creature is to destroy its head. Oh, Any okay, I can do that. Stomp it into the ground. Yep. Would really be detrimental to this Titan's well-being. As it do you think it looks like a noodly snake when it's just its head? Probably. Vegetation. That said, it has been theorized by creators of this Titan that this process of regenerating or recuperating body parts okay, can okay. be a lengthy process. Lengthy process, this you say? Just like my... Don't you say it, limbs X. I knew what you were going to say. I know. The vegetation itself. It oh, so it feels it. Okay, that sucks. Yeah, kind of does. Discharge to the surrounding areas. If true, this would be yet another. So basically, it steals the trees and then kills them. Yep. Here. You Instead suck. Of having this toxic Scratch my nose. Jeopardize okay. the world's oxygen supply. Today we learned that this animal is the strangest the monster versus. Yeah. Has in its I mean, I wouldn't call him the strangest, but, but he's definitely one of the out there? jerkier Check ones. Check out these videos and see if you can find. Oh, don't worry, we will be, baby. We've been watching all of them. Yeah, we're gonna do a reaction Thanks to the uh, Jurassic we'll Park one very soon. We got a video. dinosaur puppet and done. Yeah, baby. Don't forget to subscribe. Oh, uh, don't worry, we are. Anyways, everyone, that was Goji Center's amazing video. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe to both us and them. Check out, you know, this channel for more Godzilla videos coming very soon. And of course, for Neff. Man, Roxy's sexy. But Cougar's thumbnails are sus. Yeah, they are. Anyways, everyone, have a good day, Beacon Peel. And remember, sometimes gotta risk it for the biscuit, my dude. See ya. Bye. Let, 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 last word. Just saying it, last word. Bye.